A 31-year-old African-American mother of five walks into John Hopkins Hospital in Baltimore, Maryland, 1951, one of the few hospitals that treated black patients at the time. She tells them that she has a knot in her womb. Doctors diagnosed her with an aggressive cervical cancer and without her knowledge or consent, it took a small piece of her tumor during treatment. Story, story. Daddy. Unlike every other cell sample they'd ever seen, her cells didn't die. They kept dividing again and again and again, endlessly. Scientists called it a miracle. They named it Hella. Her cells became the foundation of modern medicine, used to develop the polio vaccine, test chemotherapy, map genes, advance IVF, and even fight COVID, all without her knowing. But while her cells were building the future, her family was left behind. Pharmaceutical companies made millions. Her descendants couldn't even afford basic healthcare. So, facts or fiction? You know the drill. Vote below. Three, two, one. This story is fact. Her name was Henrietta Lacks. That's just. She died in 1951, but her cells, Hella, lives on in labs across the world. Only in recent years has her legacy been formally recognized. Some stories don't end, they multiply. Her name may have been silenced, but her life continues to speak through every cell that lives on. Long live Henrietta Lacks.